NextJS 13's new route handler functionality in its app router makes building REST APIs super simple. Say we want to create a Pokemon REST API. First, we create a Pokemon folder in our source app directory, and then we create a route.ts file within that. That's going to handle any requests that go to the slash Pokemon route. To return a list of all our Pokemon, we respond to the get verb by simply returning a JSON payload of all of our Pokemon. Our exported post function adds a Pokemon to the list. First, it awaits the JSON body, and then it returns a JSON response that has the new ID of the database entry that we've created. To handle slash Pokemon slash one, we create a nested directory called brackets ID, and all the exposed route handling functions in that route TS file get that ID as the params in the second argument of the function when they're called. In this case, get does a JSON response with just that Pokemon. You define the delete function to delete an entity, the put function to update an entity, and the patch function, if you want to, to incrementally update an entity. It's pretty easy to make a REST API in Next.js 13's new app router.